Hi friends, welcome to Circle Time. Do you remember me? My name is Miss Sam. I'm so excited you're here with me today. I wanna to show you what we're going to do together. We have four things to do today. First, we're going to get our bodies ready to listen. Then we're going to sing a song together. Then we're going to read one of my favorite books. And then we have a special activity. After that, we will be all done with circle today. Are you ready? Let's start by getting our bodies ready to be good listeners. I think you know this song. Sing it with me if you do. Eyes are watching, ears are listening, voices quiet, bodies calm. This is how we listen. This is how we listen at group time, at group time. Nice job. We're going to take three big breaths together and then we will be ready for our song. Ready? Get your hands ready for three big breaths. One. Two. Nice job. Does your body feel calm? We are all done with that. Next on our schedule is a song. Some of you might know this song from school. It's one of my favorite songs. It's called Slippery Fish. Ready? Get your fish ready. Put your hands together and make a fish. song slippery fish is all done did you like that song I did too we're gonna read our book next we sang a song about some different kinds of ocean animals so today I picked out a book about some fish this book is called the rainbow fish the rainbow fish this is one of my favorite books what colors do you see on the rainbow fish? I see a lot of colors too. The rainbow fish was the most beautiful fish in the sea, but he never played with other fish. I'm too beautiful, he thought. Once a little blue fish asked for one of his shining scales, but the rainbow fish just laughed. Never, he said. After that, the other fish swam away from him, and Rainbow Fish was all alone. Rainbow Fish wasn't sharing, and he had no friends. 
he went to the starfish for help. Why doesn't anybody like me? He asked. Go ask the octopus, said the starfish. She is very wise. The octopus said, give away your shining scales. You won't be as beautiful, but you will have friends. <gasps> I can't do that, cried the rainbow fish. Do you think rainbow fish will share his scales? Let's find out. Suddenly, the little blue fish was back. Please, he said, could I have just one scale? Well, the rainbow fish thought, maybe just one tiny scale. The little blue fish was so pleased. It made the rainbow fish feel so happy. Soon all the fish came and the rainbow fish gave away his scales one by one. Look, he has a scale and he has a scale. They all have shining scales. Finally, Rainbow Fish had only one shining scale left. But now, as he swam off to play with his friends, he was the happiest fish in the sea. Rainbow Fish shared, and he has so many friends now. That's the end. Our book is all done. For our special activity today, friends, I would like you to find something that you like to share with your friends. I'll show you something I like to share. This is my favorite toy. One of my favorite toys. This is Mr. Potato Head, and I love sharing my parts with my friends so that they can build with me and play with me. Can you go get something that you like to share with your friends? I'll see you soon. Bye, guys.